Renewing your residence visa in the UAE will let you continue to live in the UAE legally. By the way, the question is, who is responsible for renewing your residence visa in the UAE? That was a question that I was asking one of uh, uh, the subscribers and he really needed to know. It will actually depend, remember, that some of us, we are being sponsored on what we call work sponsorship. Or it may be on a visa visa that is changed into a work visa. But still all, when you try to look at that, your residence visa is one that will enable you or that will guarantee you the stay in the UAE. And remember that when your residence visa expires, also your ID or what you call the residence permit will also expire in the same sort. But the question is, who is responsible for renewing your residence visa? Yes, the person responsible for renewing your residence visa is your sponsor, is the one that is responsible for renewing your visa. And what he has to do is that he has to, re to renew your visa before your residence visa, before its expiry. Remember that you are only given what you call a gross period of only 30 days to renew your residence visa in that case. And now that we have the residence visa and the residence permit all together, or the residence sticker visa put in the residence permit, then it becomes a little bit very easier for you to renew because all the applications are being done in what you call in one place. For those that are living in the UAE right now, for the new for, for the new procedure, you definitely know what I'm talking about. But remember, if your residence visa is renewed, then you will automatically be allowed to stay in the UAE for that period that it is renewed. And when we face that, however, something that you need to know definitely is that if it's not renewed, then you'll face the consequences. You definitely have to face the consequences if the gross period gets over. So that means... It, it is not your responsibility of the, your, your sponsor himself alone, but also you as a person. Yeah, because much as your sponsor, he may incur what you call the fines from the directorate of the passports and the foreign affairs. But what about you as a person? If it's not renewed, you're also under, under a, a, a threat or under risk at one moment of time. Because that means there are some, some things that you not do. They will not be permitted. And that is exactly that what happens. So it becomes a responsibility of me and you that you'll have to remind your sponsor in case he's the one that is supposed to renew it. You remind your sponsor in uh, time. One month before or one month before it's expired, you keep on notifying him that it's about to expire such that he gets to keep it in mind in one way or the other. However, something that you need to know as per the immigration system, you are only given what you call a gross period of only 30 days to renew your residence visa. And once it is not renewed, once it is not renewed, the residence visa in the UAE, once it's not renewed within that gross period that is being given to you, then you are going to incur what you call the fines. Your sponsor, if he's the one responsible, is going to incur fines. If you're on a free visa, you'll also get the, you'll also incur fines in whatever uh, situation it may be, depending on how you went into the UAE or on how you are living there. If you are responsible for yourself or someone else is responsible for you, you definitely have to incur those fines or he has to incur for those fines. So it becomes a responsibility of both of you to, to, to keep on reminding him because you are in need of it. You keep on reminding him to renew it a little bit earlier such that you don't face any other uh, consequences one or other. Something that you need to remember that as per the UAE, uh, UAE immigration system, there are fines that are being given. For example, for the first 60 days, if it's not renewed, that means every day you'll have to pay 25 dirhams. If your visa is not renewed per that required time and the gross period of 30 days is off, that means extra charge per day for the first 60 days it will be 
25 dirhams, which is quite very, very big amount of money. Then, to the same situation, if it is again, it is not renewed, it is again, it is not renewed for another 60 days. If it is not renewed for another 60 days, that means for the 180 days, then your charge, it will be a double charge, meaning that every single day, you will only be incurring what we call a fine charge of 50 uh, dirhams. That is by the UAE immigration system that is per, 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 the, per, per the fines that are being spirited by the fines that are being uh, put forward which you cannot get over so that means that if in the six months if in the six months your visa or your residence visa is not renewed then you'll have to incur a charge of 50 dirhams per day remember when your ex-ticker visa or when your residence visa expires even your residence permit at the same time it will expire that's what you need to know with the UAE. Still, if it is not renewed after passing a year, for example, it takes a year and it's not renewed. Let's say, for example, let's say, for example, you 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 being caught up somewhere and you you try to dodge around. Then that means per day, each fine per day will be an equivalent of what you call 100 dirhams. That will be per judge. And what will happen if again after a year you are still living in the country and it's not renewed and you, you, you caught up illegally living in the country? What is going to happen? I think that will just be what you call a ban, total ban away from the country for some time. So definitely, you get to know that introducing the new procedure whereby you need to have your residence visa and uh, the, the residence permit all together having one application that they all concurrently in, in the same residence permit that will to show all your details. It is, it's quite time sharing, it's quite time uh, saving at the end of it all. And it will give you that positivity that you, to, you need to know. But remember, in case your sponsor is the one to renew your visa, you have to remind that sponsor all the time, such that he gets to renew it in time thank you so much for coming back to this channel and thank you so much for subscribing thank you so much for don't with it don't forget to hit that notification bell because it will be the only way that will be updated whatever we have now for you ask that question i think i've just given you rightly the right answer thank you so much see you again in the next video it's mixed from the next creation